the reversible thermoelectric demonstrator allows you to qualitatively and quantitatively demonstrate the conversion of electrical energy into heat and heat energy into electrical energy. The core of the apparatus is a semiconductor that is sandwiched between two heat reservoirs. On top is a motor attached to a fan and there is a switch on the back in which you can convert this from either powering the motor or having the output go to two banana plug wires for you to measure on a multimeter. The kit comes with two cups to hold water, a pair of connecting wires, the apparatus itself, and an instruction guide. The setup is very simple. I have a cup of cold tap water with ice cubes in it and very hot water on the other side. Uh, again, whenever you're working with hot water, please exercise caution so no one gets burned. Then you just simply place this in the two cups. Its design will allow it to stand on its own. You don't need any additional support. At this moment, we are having heat being conducted up one side and heat being conducted away from the other side. After about a minute or so, just give the fan an initial turn and it should start going on its own. If it doesn't go on after about a minute, the temperature differential between the cups may not be enough or the switch on the back, which is meant to divert power either to the motor or to a voltmeter, might be in the wrong position. Now that you've seen the demonstration, I've connected a multimeter to the two banana plugs on the underside and now I'm going to flick the switch the other way so now it's putting out the voltage to the multimeter and not the motor and you can see that this particular temperature differential is about half a volt. The nice thing about this device is you don't need a digital multimeter to look at the voltage. You can use a regular analog voltmeter as well. The thermoelectric demonstrator is a reversible experiment. In the first part, you had a temperature differential and you created a voltage that you could measure or caused a motor to move. In this case, I had these connected to a power supply capable of putting out two amps. So I'm providing the electricity and I'm trying to induce a temperature differential this time. To set up this part of the experiment, you want equal parts water in both cups at the same temperature. I have a digital thermometer probe. You can use two regular alcohol thermometers or two digital thermometers. But the point is, after a minute or two, you're going to see an increase in the temperature of one cup and a decrease in the temperature of the other cup. The thermoelectric demonstrator is a very easy and convenient way for students to experience the conversion of electrical energy into heat and heat energy into electrical energy. You can see that by powering the motor on top or by actually measuring the voltage that it creates. If you want a more qualitative experiment, you can actually have the students hold this while you are applying power to this and they will feel one side will be getting cold and one side will be getting warm. The effect doesn't happen fast enough for them to be surprised by it. It's a great hands-on way for students to feel this conversion of energy.